Whoa. Okay, so is this not a secret map? This is like Pirate 2, but I'm not entirely sure if it exists or not. But when you look at this, so take a moment. Like, Tabs was just announced the other day, right? And uh, we showed off some multiplayer yeah. gameplay. We showed off the evil faction. We're going to be showing off the good faction and unlocking that and looking for a secret unit. Maybe a little multiplayer today. But the big question is, is this map that we're looking at in the background right here an April Fool's joke, a secret map, or an upcoming map? It's one of those three, but we do know that it was at the very least made. For Landfall to get this image right here, which is a still frame of a battle, it had to have been actually made. But it just eludes us. So now it's time to unlock the good faction. And then how you do that is pretty simple. You just come on down here. You don't, don't get too wet. I know you guys are excited to see this door open. But then you just go there and you look at it. You pay homage to the door that has troubled us and plagued us with questions of what is behind it for so long. And now that that question's answered. And it's done in such an epic way. It's not just like you do that and it's like, oh, hey, you unlock this thing. Like there's this whole experience. Just enjoy it. This is, this is something we've been waiting for. I mean, the totally accurate battle simulator journey started in the summer of 2016, at least for most of us. For landfall, maybe a little bit earlier. And now... The portal opens. Questions do remain like, where the heck are all of the chickens? But don't worry, we're gonna go through the hole. <laughs> the portal, I guess. And now you find yourself in the good campaign. Now, as far as where are the good guys, I don't see anything. I literally don't see anything. Oh, fantasy good. This is just the map. Okay, we've unlocked the map. Well, if we go to the main menu then, I'm kind of tempted to jump into multiplayer. But let's do a little bit of campaign just to see the good and then we'll hop into campaign uh, multiplayer in a moment. Protected advanced. I think we can deal with this. So they've got a guy with some kind of a force field. It, it is a butterfly fairy. Okay. And then we got these three dudes who look like they're straight out of just like, I don't even know. Oh shoot, we're surrounded. Okay. So protected advance. I feel like we're gonna need to obviously do this the only way we know how. Hobbits. Will hobbits be able to fight off these uh, magical beings of good? I mean, it's it's just a it's just a strategy, okay? This is the totally accurate strategy simulator, and the best way to do it is send furry-footed hobbits in to fight wizards here. and people with magic abilities. Look, I mean, look at this! <laughs> look at what is happening! They're ripping the wings off the butterfly people. It's the only way to do it, and then they carry the bodies. And come on, hobbits. Let's let's rock walk away with a victory here. I don't know what this guy's doing. He's like kicking, kicking and screaming. Oh, he just kicked him. Okay, it it may not have worked, but you know what? We have the memories of it. So then you can you know your, your parents ask you, hey, what what did you do today? Just be like, I sent a bunch of small people to their doom. Just say that. See what happens. Actually, I would. I I don't, I don't know if I can advise that. I'm gonna send two champions and a bunch of footmen to defeat these guys. I feel like, yeah, they have force fields, but it only defends against range. You know what? We, we need to confirm that, do we not? All right, do the arrows go through these protected force fields? <laughs> they didn't even get a fire. I mean, I did put them on the front line. That's like my first tabs video ever. All right. Oh, that's amazing. They don't work, but I guess the force fields don't last forever. And as a result, some of the enemies did die to arrow fire. This is glorious. And I'm going to concentrate all my army over here at first and just send them in. Yeah, th th this is working pretty well. Get big guys with armor and swords against butterflies. That's, <laughs> that's, that's what we're fighting today. Butterflies and fantastic mustaches. But wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on. I'm going to pause this because look at this island. If I can get there, is there a secret? I mean, I'm getting close. Oh, no. That's as close as you can get. But some of them are a little bit closer. Ooh. Because on the evil map, there was a secret unit. Hold on. There looks like there may be something. Yes. What are you? Look at that. Hey, hey. Come here. Yeah, I, I was just joking. Solar architect. Okay. It's like the elves from Lord of the Rings built a city in the clouds. All right. Now back to the battle. <laughs> Casually stopping the first campaign level to unlock a secret unit. Dang, this guy's strong. But sword through neck is death. Determined guard. Very fascinating. The butterfly people are here. Oh, shoot. There's a new unit. 
He's got a big old glowing mallet and a shield. Oh my god, okay, there's two new guys. These are the, the glaive guards, I think. Let's use these guys on me. These guys are really dangerous. I've got 4,500 bucks, chieftains. Actually, what if we just used hoplites? And I like to just focus on one side. Oh god, glaive guards are really good range. Everything's just dying, and then I think that guy summoned a hammer from above. Oh, God. I think, and they have shields, too. And there's a whole nother army of these guys. They're strong. They're good melee. They're ranged and melee. Okay, great. Fantastic. Cool. We're gonna die. Minotaur, your task is to destroy that guy with the hammer. Oh, big hit. He missed with the hammer. The archers are supposed to fire and hit some glaive guards. That's the goal here. All right, come on. This guy's strong, but, I mean, you guys just have a lot more swords than they do. Okay, Minotaur's dead. These guys aren't gonna do too well. Archers are just hitting shields. I don't think they've killed anything. Archers were a bad choice. Maybe we have to fight evil with good. I mean, we have to fight good with evil. Maybe that's a terrible strategy. But what if we stopped all that and just went into a quick match of multiplayer against random people on the internet? Oh, that's a- there's guns going off in the background. Hosted by... Rocco Beltrone. Hello, Rocco. He's building an army. I'm gonna build an army too. Oh, I gotta see his units. Okay, Snake Archer. What if I did Shadow Walker? Oh, we only get 20 units. Okay, that, that's another thing to account for. We get 20,000 gold, but 20 units. Whoa. Oh, oh, what's this? A clam boy. Okay. Oh, and cheerleader. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be awesome. I know how to beat this. Clams, you know what? I've got 20 guys, right? Okay, ice giant. And I think what we need is some snipers from the Renaissance faction. This is really, okay, I'm good to go. All right, so I basically just put a bunch of muskets down. I feel like there's definitely an advantage to whoever goes last, right? And that, that was me. So, uh, sorry, Rocco. <laughs> Hey, it's new match in six, so let's see if things change it up a bit, okay? The campaign was kind of stalling out. I was like, you know what? I don't have the brain power to deal with this right now. So let's scrap all of it, and I think it's my turn to go first. I'm gonna just put... There you go. What are you gonna do against 20 jousters? There you go, buddy. I, you know what? I, I think it's only fair. Oh, he went horsos with lassos? Horsos. <laughs> There's a horse with a lasso. This is kind of funny. Oh, and a guy with dynamite. And a couple guys with dynamite. Okay. So you got lassos and, and, and I got big sharp sticks. Uh, it looks like it's going well for me. <laughs> but I mean, he could have he could have taken the time to counter it. I think he's just having a great time. That's something, you know what? I, I appreciate you, Rocco. I appreciate you. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna delete that too. Now, I'm gonna make the Fellowship of the Rings. We got Gandalf. Now, you know we need the four hobbits. Sam, Mary, Pippin, and Frodo. Um, we need Boromir. That's Boromir. And then this will be Aragorn. And now we need an elf. We need a really good elf. And I, I think I know just the one. The elf, Legolas. And now we need a dwarf. We need a dwarf. Who would be our dwarf? We need a dude with a big hammer, big axe. Okay, I mean, come on. There you go. I'm just gonna do that. You know what? Y you gonna kill the Fellowship of the Ring? That's illegal. Don't do that. I've only got nine units. 9,420. I don't even think he spent all of his money. And the Fellowship is not doing very good. I mean, we summoned a Balrog. How appropriate. This is literally the Fellowship of the Ring, the movie. Whoa, we killed the demon. Oh my God, am I gonna live? I mean, I guess I do have... Oh my gosh, the Fellowship of the Ring has defeated the Balrog. I'm surprised that worked. We even fought some Oliphants too. The Herodrim were here, apparently. So random battles on the internet. Who's been playing the download? Who's been playing the newest update? He's got new hub. Okay, a bunch of hobbits. I'm gonna get... I know what I'm gonna do. No, 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 no. Keep it. Keep it, I got an idea. One Taekwondo guy. I'm gonna just fight him with one Taekwondo guy. I, I really like this. Wait, he's, he's writing something. He was writing something, I think, or, or maybe attempting to, but you only have a limit of 20 units. So, <laughs> this was a bad idea. I wanted to kick at least a couple of them. <laughs> okay, Rocco kicked my butt. Yeah, I mean, I feel like the Fellowship of the Ring strategy is, is viable. It, it seemed to have worked. Okay. Oh, we got those guys? Okay, what's good against that? Maybe Samurai. Or maybe... Oh, it's a cheerleader. Okay, I've got an idea. Zeus. Bunch of Zeuses. <laughs> I don't care how many birds you got, Birdman. <laughs> it's unfair. Oh, gosh. Oh, man. This is amazing, though, that this is even happening. Like, remember, like, 
Blitz and I have done multiplayer before where we've had to go like to all of these like extensive methods in order to like actually be able to play multiplayer. And now it's just real. Okay. Oh shoot, it's the giants. Okay, giants, all the giants. What are giant slayers? Oh, and he's got a horse. Hmm. What if I just did this? Let's just see if that works. It's not gonna work, but you know what? All of the mythological beasts are fighting us. Gentlemen, you must hold the line. This is the Great Wall of China. You will defend it. Okay, we killed the Minotaur. The knight's dead. And now <laughs> four giants, including a wooly mammoth, are here. And everybody's dead. <laughs> But this is so much fun. Like, here we go. Oh my god. Oh, I thought the ice giant had block ability, but I think it was the samurai giant behind him. Soldier, run. Run and hide. But uh, is this a game that you're playing against random people, or you're just playing your friends? Like, I, I don't know how they'd really do matchmaking or anything like that. Okay, we'll do... Oh, <gasps> no! Well, we lost our random friend on the internet. Rocco, you will be missed. Let's see who else we can find. Ooh, select a map. I choose new one. Fantasy good. The volatile gaming. Okay. I give you homage. There's my clubber. Your move, volatile. Oh, there's a zombie. Ew. Look at that scary face. Oh, smiley face. Here we go. Oh, hobbits. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm going to try it again. One, two, three, four. Oh, he's got the demon in here. But I mean, this has worked before. Okay, now Legolas. Now we need Gimli. And I, you know what? The Fellowship of the Ring, baby. We got Boromir, Aragorn, Legolas, Gimli, Sam, Mary, Pip, and Frodo. All right. <laughs> oh, no. He just nuked Legolas into the... Oh. Ooh, Mr. Butterfly King. Oh, he's got two Butterfly Kings. Okay, so needless to say, the Phillips of the Ring got absolutely wrecked. In fact, these guys didn't even turn in to the Balrog. So it, maybe it's not as good of a strategy as we thought. But can we compliment it? Should we bring a Balrog of our own and a Chronomancer of our own? I mean, we got four, three... Four thousand dollars left. I think he's resting on his laurels here. So we're bringing in a giant. We've, we've got a cave troll. And then how about some? Oh, what? You can't just cancel that. Volatile. See, this is the thing, though. Like, I think what this game needs is blind unit selection. See, look how he's rushing us over there. Now, in order to defeat that. I'm gonna put some firework boys over here. And he'll probably put a guy right here. Yeah, see, like, you can't do this. We need to, well, you can, and he is. But you need a multiplayer blind. Otherwise, there's gonna be the one guy, like in the first battle, we had a great fun. Me and me and, my, me and that guy were just enjoying ourselves, right? And then this one, it's just like, okay. Yeah, we get it. You can easily counter my units, you know what I mean? But if it was blind, then that would be super exciting. Because how many battles are just like this constant, like, and there's no timer. If there was a timer though, that could work too. Hey, I think, was that our demon? Nope, I think he's dead. Oh, look, our Chronomancer lost his wings and fell off the cliff. But we do have the Balrog still. Balrog versus Ice Giant. Who wins? Oh, it looked like he had a, a was picking up the katana in his hand for a second. Oh, okay. He countered my units, but we still won. I, I think that just shows the power of the demon. But I mean, we've shown quite a bit. Why, why is the screen grayed out? I don't think it's supposed to be. I, one last thing I wanted to try was to see if there's any secrets. There we go, we fixed it. Cause maybe, like there's, isn't there a treasure room on this map? There's some things that should be checked, but I don't know. I, I, I don't think so. There's just so many objects on it. This. this is one of the most ornate and detailed maps. Okay, it's not the treasure map. Then I, I think it, it only if we pray to the holy, Chicken. Well, we find out what's going on, but uh, I mean, honestly, the chicken's not even in the game. I don't know how to get to that secret pirate level, guys. If you do, let me know. There's, you know the phrase when one door open, uh, one door closes, another door opens? Well, in this case, I feel like when one door opens, another one closes. We, we have the answer to the doors, but we do not have an answer to the secret pirate ship level. So anyway, guys, thank you for watching another episode of Totally Act Battle Simulator. If you did enjoy the video, pull the trigger on the like button, subscribe if you're new, and I will see you in the next one.